guys, here's my 5 to 1 skill fight against Melek and I decided to wear the spiky brutal helm so that this was the battle of the spike heads and a 5 to 1 fight means you have one fifth of the titan's level as stat points so I could have a maximum of 14,635 stat points and I actually had 14,629 and you can't have any potions so I was showing I didn't have any equipped and also you can't have ultimate magic or second chance and you can only have one hexagon gem either a titan break gem or a perfect parry stun gem and I decided to go for the perfect parry stun gem to get more breaks but because of that I didn't have many hits in my attack break so I didn't do many bonus combos I mainly stuck to normal combos as I could get more in with the few hits that I could do in my attack break but every time I got a longer attack break then I did go for bonus combos so when he did step backs and four exclamation mark breaks basically then I went for bonus combos to get the extra attack so you may be wondering what a 5 to 1 skill fight is well it was created on the Infinity Blade forum on the Epic Games site and I've put a link to the forum in the description under this video and there's a number of skill fights that have been created that you can enter as another challenge in the game and 5 to 1 skill fights are a big part of that and you need to start by doing a 5 to 1 against the worker after his level 10,000 I believe and then you can fight other bosses at 5 to 1 and there's this achievement which is I think the boss king and it's where you fight all bosses at 5 to 1 and so I've been very slowly working my way through them <laughs> one every few months and I'm getting there and I've got a playlist on all the 5 to 1 skill fights that I've done and also on my own forum Tamil channel forum there's a thread on skill fights as well and you can try and complete different fights on my forum and there's a different variety to the ones on the Epic Games forum but basically what they have in common is that 5 to 1 is as I said one fifth of the Titans level as total stats and that means the stats of your gear as well as any gems and you can only equip stat gems so that your stats meet the right amount and that's basically it no weapon specific gems no dark fire no defense and like I said no second chance or ultimate magic and I decided to go for no magic because I'm just that good <laughs> and also as I said the perfect parry stun gem so that I could get a lot of breaks and I did because I think the tawnies really improve your skills and I get perfect parries now a lot more than I used to so I was getting a lot of breaks so Melik was a bit tougher than I thought he was going to be <laughs> I thought I'd finish him off in one go but it actually took me about an hour to do this so I did do quite a few attempts um, he's alright in the first cutscene but in the second scene his legs start getting involved <laughs> and he's got a lot of fancy moves there so you do have to watch his legs more than his arms really so it did take me a few attempts because of the unexpected kicks but I got the step backs down really well actually and that windmill move that he did I find that quite easy to crack now and before I had trouble with that but it's actually not that hard at all you just got to time the left dodge right and wait for him to when he jumps up and wait to move to the left and then stay there until he's landed and done his first swipe after he lands and then you can come back and duck I think it is 
and that's okay. So it wasn't as hard as I thought. It was actually his um, succession of swipes, step back, not the one where he jumps back, but where he does, where he jumps in the air right in front of you. That was a little harder because you've got to get the timing just right for his second swipe. But still, I managed to crack them all. And I did crack them with dodging because of the longer attack break at the end of a, with a dodge break. And I covered that recently in my fighting skills video. And that's what gave me the idea to do this now because I've been showing fighting skills. So <laughs> I thought I'd show them in action at a high level where you're really used to the game. And I do get asked quite a lot, you know, how long have you been playing and how come you're good at it? <laughs> well, basically, I've been playing a long time. And so for Infinity Blade 3, I've been playing since the game was released. And I actually started before that with Infinity Blade 2. So I have been playing Infinity Blade for four years now. So, you know, after you've been playing a while, you it's okay to do these sort of things. But not that you have to wait four years, you know. But by trying the challenges, you will get better. It will improve your skills at the fight. So it depends how much, you know, you want to get into the game. And as I say, there's a lot of fights and achievements you can get on the Epic Games forum. So, you know, it's worth having a look at that forum if you're interested in the game because it does add another dimension and you know more interesting things to do and they are a real challenge so it is a lot of fun and you know you can do more in the game trying to complete these achievements and the same as I said on my forum if you want to check those out too because we have got some other achievements that are different to the ones on Epic Game Forum. So yeah, check out both forums if you'd like to get more involved in the game. It is a great game and that's why I do continue to play it. I still believe it's the best one in the App Store because of the graphics and the gameplay. So it's definitely worth you know having fun with it for as long as you can. So maybe we'll see you on the forum and trying out a skill fight because they are a lot of fun and very challenging. So I'm getting close now to finishing Malik off and it was good fun fighting him with a spike helmet of my own so <laughs> we were equally matched and he wasn't going to scare me with those spikes. <laughs> So I hope you enjoyed this fight. Melik is down and that's another one towards my entry for the Boss King achievement. Thanks for watching Tamil Channel, your favourite channel for Infinity Blade. If you enjoyed the video, please like, comment and subscribe and check out my website and social pages. Thanks, see you next time.